Yo, yo, dogs and gangsters, welcome to episode 4, season 3, College Cooking, here with Gustav's who's down my light just turned off. I'm wearing my lucky Perry the Platypus shirt, so it's pretty awesome. Today's recipe- oh, it turned back on again. <laughs> oh man. I'm making baked potatoes today. Enjoy. Alright, we'll begin with step one, which is bake- no, turn on the oven to 400 degrees. Or 420. 425, yes. 425 degrees. Preheat. Next, the prudent scholar would give them a quick rub down with their hands. That way you don't get uh, any of that toxic potato dust in your system. I use the word prudent because I have a big vocabulary. Scrubbed potato. Let's try another one, make sure it's in the shot. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Scrub potato. Yeah, yeah. That is one ugly potato. So the oven isn't actually preheated, but ain't nobody got time for that. So next you take your potatoes and you can just plop them directly onto the oven rack. We're not trying to be fancy here, we're just trying to pick potatoes, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, dogs? Ah, oh, hopefully all of my viewers are gangsters this week because I am referring to you guys as gangsters. Gosh darn it. There we go, baked potatoes. Wait, no, we have to give it some time and then they'll become baked potatoes. Uh, once the potatoes are in the oven, the preheated oven, you can set the timer for uh, about 20 minutes. And then we wait. See you in 20 minutes. So I'm recalling that when my mom used to make these potatoes, baked potatoes that is, she used to poke the potatoes midway through baking. So uh, I'm gonna do that just because I think, no, they're too hard. No, no, we're not gonna do that. Never mind. Cut. Hello, dear friends. Nemo's in the nope, kitchen nope, now. Nope. Nope. Nope, nope, Nemo is not in the kitchen. So I just got off the phone with El Mamo. And she told me, she said, Gustav, 350 degrees for one hour. So, uh, redo what I told you before and do that instead. Bake. Alright. Bake. No, start. Wait. Bake. Start. Timer. Uh, we did 20 minutes, so we'll do 40 minutes now. Perfect. We are golden. Skookum. I just learned that word. Skookum. Hello, chickadees. All right, so usually you're supposed to put the toppings inside or on top of the potato, but I was getting a little impatient, and the potatoes are still baking, so here we go. Um, this is what I'm going to be putting on them. I've got some butter, some bacon, some sour cream, and some cheese. Really, you should put some chives on there, and maybe some other spices and veggies or whatever. I don't know, whatever you're into, green onions, that kind of thing. But this is not what I'm doing. So we'll wait for the potatoes, and we'll plop them on, stick them on, maybe mash it together a little, and it's gonna be tasty good. Alrighty, and just like this, my friends, the timer is timing. No, it's not timing. We open up the oven, the potatoes look baked. We turn off this, because we do not want it anymore. Yes, we are ready. We have our mitt, that way we don't burn our hands on these hot potatoes, just like the game. Then you take it out of the oven, you put it on your toppings. I'm only going to eat two of them for dinner tonight because more than two baked potatoes is a lot. So there we go. We'll just leave these ones in the oven for now until I'm done filming eating. Good day. Good day, my friends. Good day. Hasta la vista. Alrighty, so here we go. We've got these all here. Next we're going to take our fork and make a schlit in the top. For those of you who don't know what a schlit is, it's like a slit but you pronounce it funny. So, like that. Bada bim, bada bang. Bada bam, bada balooza. Bada bingo. Oh man, I don't think that's cooked all the way. Darn it. All right, 
Well, it's a good thing I left the rest of those potatoes in there. But anyway, at this point you scoop it all inside, like that. Scoop it inside, put that butter in there, close it up, let it melt for a minute, put some sour to creme, and then you eat it. Uh, I'm probably going to eat these even though they're undercooked. So, uh, let's do that. Let's do that, man. Let's do that. Oh, look at that shirt. Perry the platypus. We're going to do that an artistic shot. Look at eyes. It's like, my eyes are down here, you guys. My eyes are down here. Um, okay, let's eat this. Let's eat this. Oh, the smaller potato is fully cooked. That's good. I'm really just rambling. I've got no focus. I've got no focus, just hocus and pocus. Wow, I am truly a poet. You can call me Dr. Seuss. Or Dr. Goose. Dr. Lutz. Dr. Moose. Dr. Foose Ball. Dr. Small. I'm not even a doctor. <laughs> Besides the fact that the potato is burning my mouth off, that was pretty tasty. Basically, it just tasted like a big bite of bacon, and it was amazing. It was amazing, I tell you. Let's get another bite of this tasty. I think the trick is lots of sour cream, and lots of cheese, and lots of butter, and lots of bacon. The less potato, the better. Let's get another bite of this, this here tasty goodness. I didn't get any of the potato in that bite. <laughs> so this clip is going on about two minutes. So I think it's time to end the video. Have a great week. Enjoy yourself. Do good things. Be a good person.